Well, imagine suddenly and without warning being struck with shock like pain in the face. A pain that for many never ever goes away. In today's HealthCast, Local 10 medical specialist Christy Kruger shows us how doctors are able to give some patients permanent relief. You got the book? When Vidal Garcia started feeling facial pain about seven years ago, he thought it was a dental problem. So I went to my dentist and then he referred me to a specialist. And then after that, the specialist said, no, 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 this is this. You have to go to a neurologist. He was diagnosed with trigeminal neuralgia, a condition that affects about 150,000 people every year. It's interesting. It's one of those diseases where you can always ask a patient if they remember exactly when it started. So it starts, it's like an on and off switch, and then usually it doesn't go away on its own. Dr. Simon Butrek, a neurosurgeon with Memorial Healthcare, says initially most patients do respond to medication. And about 90% of people get relief with that. But usually over the course of years, either they can't tolerate the side effects, or they need additional drugs, or it just stops working. When that happened in Vidal's case, he became a candidate for a surgical procedure called microvascular decompression, which now can be done with a minimally invasive approach. Surgeons address the source of the pain, an artery pressing right on a nerve that supplies sensation to the face. You find the nerve, you find the artery, you separate them and you put a little spacer between them. Now, instead of taking several medications every day, Vidal is down to just one pill and living pain free. I'm so grateful for the doctor for this procedure uh, that it really changed my life. Changed his life for the better. And while that pain relief isn't 100% guaranteed, follow-up data finds that five to 10 years after that surgery, three quarters of the patients are still symptom-free. Louie.